Hey guys, how are you doing? Hopefully you're having a great day. Surprise, surprise, we're out here with Aaron once again. As you guys saw, Seb just pulled in. We are fishing a brand new lake today that um, apparently has some very large crappie. So, I mean, there's going to be four of us out there fishing. We're bound to catch something. Um, we do have a little bit of a late start to the day. The roads were very bad this morning, but Aaron, are you excited? Very excited. What was that? Very excited. We've been fishing for crappie for the past, what, four days? No, three days we've been out together. Yeah. Uh, three days, four days, four days, four days, four four days, days two videos. We skipped a day. We skipped a day. Four days, two videos. Um, we've been catching crappie, but they haven't really been anything big. So hopefully today we can change that and actually get some decent sized crappie. <laughs> So, on the way back, we are going to take the road because um, this is probably our, this is definitely our fault because we just didn't check the ice. Uh, we are we assumed that it was safe ice. We know people have been fishing here, um, but I don't know how well you guys saw that on the GoPro footage, but we kind of. <laughs> just you know <laughs> I don't know how we didn't sink but um uh, we made it to our our crappy spots this is all like Seb's intel I have no idea where we are or what we're going to be doing but Seb seems to be very confident so we're just going to see what he does we've got to first of course locate the crappy and then second get them to bite which is the hard part <laughs> with crappy, but we're in, we're in for a good day. We're, as you guys can see, on a beautiful lake. Yeah, Aaron's a little, Aaron almost pooped himself on the right here. We were literally just, we were, it was normal. Like we were sledding, we were ripping it, right? It's better to go fast than to go slow. So we were ripping it and all of a sudden, like, f first I saw Seb, because he was a little bit in front of us, just kind of butt down a little bit. He's on a sled, we're on an ATV, it's a little different. And then all of a sudden, I look down and we're breaking ice. Um, we went down a little bit, Aaron almost pooped himself, I almost pooped myself, but check the ice, guys, <laughs> and wear floater suits, please invest in a floater suit, and, uh, have some pics on you all the time. <laughs> Which way do we drill? Uh, that way? Feet. Okay. So the thing that Aaron and I have found over the past couple of days of crappy fishing is that we don't really have an issue locating the fish, like lo locating the school. It's getting the fish to actually bite. There's, you can tell a difference between an active fish and an inactive fish. And what we have found is that the fish biting correlates a lot with the feeding window so some of you guys may not know this but there's feeding windows based on the moon phase um i actually believe in it i did like a little experiment two years ago uh with the f with the feeding phase bass fishing though in the summertime and i definitely found that the fish are more active and more willing to bite moving baits at least um during the majors and the minors. Seb likes the minors, I like the majors, um, but we have a minor between 11.30 and 12.30 or so, and the past couple of days around that time between like 11 and 1.30 was, or has been our major, um, has, been, has been the period where we've caught most of our crappies. So, I mean, it's still early, it's probably nine or so. We still have a little bit of time. I think we found the fish. We're here. Seb's checking over there. I think we found the fish. I think we just have to wait for the feeding period now for them to actually turn on. Game on. Aaron. Aaron. I'm going to get smashed. Aaron. 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 No! <laughs> Holy. No, they're chasing me. I'm getting chased right now. 
I don't think they like the pink. Must be a color deal, no? Yeah. Or the bait. Your bait's very stiff. Yeah? Doesn't have a lot of action. <sighs> okay, game on. Come up, come up. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't think it's that big. I think that's big. Oh my god! Yeah! <laughs> yes! Finally a decent sized grabby. Look at that! Yes! There's another one down there too. <laughs> You're right. They like the little softer one. You go you get down there. There she is, guys. What is that? Ten inches? Ten. Ten, and a half. ten and a half, eleven inch fish. My PB is actually 11 and a half, so this is cutting it pretty close. She rose, as you guys saw, and bit when I switched up to a, what actually stole Aaron's bait, but beautiful. Crap, we finally the size that we're looking for. All right, beautiful crappie. Back down the hole. saw the fish kind of come off bottom and then rise to the bait and then they can continue rising I've hooked most of my fish up here or they can go back down and screw off so this is the strike zone and this is the no-go zone this is also the zone where you have to get the fish to come to the strike zone <laughs> look how big that mark is no you think so yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm shitting myself. You have to go to fish as close to Isabella as possible. <laughs> he was rising so slowly too. Like a dun 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 dun. Can right. come move to my spot? I'm gonna come show you guys I've done. A little bait here. This is the sauce from Sivas Outdoors. You yeah, boy! <laughs> oh, look at this thing. This thing is ugly. I know, but Ugly got bit twice already. Oh, no, obviously, for sure. <laughs> the only thing that got bit is Ugly. Yeah. Nice. Look at that. Yummy. Seb just got one. Nice. I have one on my screen now, so I hope it's a crappie this time. Let's see. There we go. Ooh, bigger perch or a crappie. Nice. <laughs> Little one. Ooh, he didn't even think about it either. He rose, rose, rose and grabbed it. Yeah. They're eating it. They're eating it so good. Look at that. <laughs> nice, nice feature. Feature 16 incher. Yeah. The better one. It's a better one. Oh no! It just fought hard. It's not a better one. <laughs> Seven inches, six inches. Came up and ate it though. It's awesome. Whew. Yep. 
Yeah. <laughs> They're all the same size though. It's funny, this fish came in with three other fish. Two of them were the same mark as this, and one mark was like twice as big. Yeah. And the big mark came up first and then domed me, and then this guy came up and ate it. This is, this is my safety hat. Yeah. This is for when you go through the ice. Yeah. Is that what it's for? Yeah, so this floats. Yeah, so you float. No. No? No. Just the hat? Just this, so they know where to look for the, the body. <laughs> yeah. Nice. <laughs> we got our safety precaution for the through. way back. We broke through. We did the right thing. You saw me broke through your trying to go, right? Yeah, we did. Yeah. You saw how deep we were. How deep were we in the oh, water? Guys. Yes, the wheels were underwater. Nice. I'll go back. Alright guys, so that is a wrap for today's video. As you guys saw, we took a different route. We didn't we didn't even check really if we how much we broke through in that channel, but I don't really want to go back there anyways. We found another way off the lake and um, as you guys can see we're in the car, we're safe. So lesson learned. Um, what's what's the lesson learned, I guess? Make make sure, make sure we'll, you know where you're going. But the, but the thing is, we had like make sure you, make sure you know where you're going because we had like five six inches of ice yeah. just in that channel. We did not have five six inches of ice, and we didn't really know there was current in there either. It's probably because of current, right? I assume so. Yes. Yes. So um, that was fun. The biggest crappie of the day was my first fish, probably about 10, 11 inches. Yeah. Yeah, ten eleven inches, which is not a bad fish. Um, like an inch short of my PB actually. There's a lot of a very good sized fish in here, crappie. I had some massive, massive marks. Uh, we just couldn't get them to bite, unfortunately. But who knows? Maybe we'll be back. Yeah, we'll be oh, back. Yeah. Oh, we're gonna be back. We're gonna be back. There's just too many good marks here that. Um, it's not going to be in the back of our mind whenever we want to go crappy fishing now. We just need a safe access point. But other than that, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to leave Seb's channel link down below in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next one.